All right, well, I thought I'd take a look at today's digits puzzle again. This is the math puzzle where we have six numbers that we have to use to make up the bigger number. And there's gonna be five different uh, goal numbers or target numbers that we're trying to get to. And we're trying to get all five of them to get all 15 stars. So 65, uh, I mean, well, it's obviously two times three, which is six times 10, add five. And I'm just now remembering that some people have told me if I go in the settings, chain mode there we go if i turn on chain mode now once i do uh you know if i do like two times three equals six the six is going to be already highlighted so all right um 159 this is a multiple of three it would be 53 times nine or 50 53 times three in fact um we can get 53 but that uses the three two times 25 plus three would do it then we're using the three, and I'm not sure that's gonna be a good way to do it. Okay, so, um, let's see, 25 times six is 150. Oh, well that's what we do. Two times three. Oh, and see, now I'm used to the other way. 150 plus nine, there you go. Easy, easy, I was trying to make it more complicated than it was. All right, 294, again, multiple of three. Um, not a multiple of nine. Is it a multiple of six? It is a multiple of six. Because if it's a multiple of three and it's even, then it's a multiple of six. So this would be uh, 49 times six. Can we get 49 somehow? Maybe, maybe we can. 49, let's see, if we do, this would be 56, we'd have to subtract seven. Almost 36, we would need to add 13. These two make 32. Hmm. So it's 49 times 6, but I'm not sure how to get to 49. Oh! Oh no, that's 39. Oh shoot! I was gonna say, if we add all the other five together, we get 49, but we don't, we get 39. If you do four plus eight, plus nine, plus 11, plus seven, you get 39. But we need 49 times six, right? Yeah, yeah. That's close, that's close. Uh, four times seven is 28. We would need another 21. Doesn't quite work. So, ooh, oh wait, no, no, no. Yeah, 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 49. Yeah, 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 seven times seven is 49. There we go, 49 times six, 294. There we go, okay. I just didn't break it down enough. Uh, all right, 357, again, multiple of three. Um, not a multiple of six this time, but it is a multiple of three, which would be, what would it be, 119 times three? 119, well, seven times 15 is 105. We would need 14 more, yeah. Seven times 15 plus eight, plus six, times three, 357. There we go, all right. Last time I really struggled on the fourth one, so I'm glad I got through that one quick. All right, 456, again, multiple of three. These are all multiples of three, and this one is also a multiple of six, that's interesting. Uh, the first one was not a multiple of three, but the rest of them have a multiples of three. Um, this one, multiple of six, not a, or multiple of three and six, but not nine, and we've got the nine there. We don't have a three, not really. Not a, not a good way to get to three anyway, so that's not great. Uh, 450 would be, you know, 50 times nine. 50 times nine would be 450. Uh, we can't really get 50 very well, but we can get 46. That's not great. Uh, so 20 times... 
20 is 400. 20 times 23 is 460. How about 20 times 22? We could do 22 pretty easily. It's 440, then we need 16. It's not great. It's not great. 16 is not easy to get from those. So let's not do that. I mean, we can do 24 times 20, which would get us 460. Right? If we do these, that's 460. Or no, 480. Sorry, 480. Glad I typed it in. Uh, so then we would need to subtract 24. And... Doesn't quite work. 7 times 13 is 91 times 5 is going to get us really close. We're only 1 away, but then how do we get... Oh, and 1! 20 minus 19 is 1. There we go. Add those together. 456. Okay, well there was probably a better way to do that. But it worked. So that's all that really matters. Got there. All right, well, cool. Let me know which one of these numbers you had the hardest time with, which ones you did a different method than I did. I'm guessing there was a better way to do that last one. It felt a little convoluted the way I did it, but it worked, so whatever. Anyways, let me know how this digits went for you today. Be sure to like and subscribe, and I'll see you again soon with some more puzzles. We'll pick a random available seat. Why? Who knows? That's just the kind of thing hypothetical passengers do. Um, that's pretty good. Let's go with that. Wow, no way. <laughs> yeah, I mean, either a part or short could be right, or neither of them could be right, who knows. I mean, 20 times 11 is 220, then we would need to add 53, 40 plus 13 is 53, there we go. 11 times 20, 220, 